Let me hit Urban Meyer here for a second. I hope Urban Meyer gets healthy. I hope that he feels stupendous for the rest of his days. But there is no way that any reasonable person who is watching college football can defend Urban Meyer's behavior on the sideline in that Maryland game. Urban Meyer was intentionally drawing attention to how poorly he supposedly feels from a health perspective so that I believe he can use his health as the reason why he's going to leave Ohio State at the end of the season just like he did at Florida. That is what is going on at Ohio State. Urban Meyer built a program at Florida that won a lot of games but had no foundation. And as the foundation began to collapse, Urban Meyer skedaddled right out of Gainesville and blamed his health for why he couldn't coach anymore. The minute that Ohio State came open, miraculously, Urban Meyer got healthy again. It's an extraordinary series of events that Urban Meyer, who claims he's on death's doorstep when he's at Florida, sits out for a year, miraculously gets healthy, goes to Ohio State. What's happening at Ohio State is a mirror image for what happened at Florida. There is a poor foundation there. That foundation is starting to collapse. Six most recent road games in the Big Ten gave up 55 points to Iowa, 49 points to Purdue, and just gave up 51 points to Maryland. This is a team that is slowly beginning a collapse. They were incredibly fortunate to beat Penn State on the road. They were incredibly fortunate if that Maryland quarterback just hits the wide open receiver on the two-point play, Ohio State loses that game. They are collapsing around him and rather than ride Ohio State down, Urban Meyer is going to do what he did at Florida. He's going to skedaddle right out of town just in time before the collapse occurs. I said on my radio show a while ago that if you follow Urban Meyer's career, what he may well do is sit out a year and then take another job. That's why I said, man, if USC sticks with Clay Helton, they're going to be trying to seduce Urban Meyer to come out to LA that entire time. And it fits with the overall Urban Meyer game plan, which is go to a conference that is at the bottom and get the best program there or one of the best programs, ride it back up to the top, and then bail as soon as people catch up with what you're doing. It's exactly what he did at Florida. That's what he's done at Ohio State. That's what he could do at USC. Pac-12 right now very down. And it wouldn't surprise me at all if Urban Meyer decided to take $7 million a year and go to USC. I don't buy the health situation with Urban Meyer. You can say I'm an awful human being. I don't believe it. If he truly is so unhealthy that he is near collapse on the sideline, he shouldn't be coaching. He shouldn't be on the sideline at all coaching if he is as ill as he wants us all to believe based on his behavior. I just don't buy it based on the precedent set at Ohio State already and also on the precedent set at Florida. He's on his way out.